there, friends. My name is Sarah Duma, otherwise known as Where in the World is Carmen San Diego? from when I hiked part of the Appalachian Trail in 2014. And it's seven hours before I leave for the airport. I have an early morning flight to San Diego. Uh, I packed everything in one day and I'm going to show you my gear. So I'm going to start out with uh, my clothing. It's not clothing, but I'm gonna take this Mont Bell umbrella. I'm gonna try it out, don't like it, I'll send it home. I have some dirty Z-Pax rain mitts. Also a very dirty Z-Pax Cuban fiber raincoat. And continuing with the Z-Pax theme, Z-Pax rain skirt. Next up, my shoes. I'm going to be uh, not pictured here bringing two pairs of darn tough socks, but those are waiting for me in San Diego. So other than that, uh, just one other pair of socks, these uh, toe socks, which I like. They keep my toes happy. I wear them after hiking. Uh, Dirty Girl Gators, keep all the sand out of my shoes. These are Salomon Odyssey Pros, and I have cut out the back because it rubs my heel. And uh, I wore them for over a thousand kilometers on the Via de la Plata Camino, and my other shoes had no wear and tear on the tread. So I have high hopes they're gonna last a long time along the trail before I need to replace them. And inside I have the Berry Super Feet insoles. Okay. These are possum down gloves, really warm for the weight. This is just a generic fleece hat. I bought it in Spain at Decathlon for like two bucks. Uh, I'm going to be wearing to hike in these Decathlon running pants. Now they might get too hot. They probably will get too hot. So I'll just buy some other capris or shorts when I need to. And then uh, for sleeping, I have some Patagonia synthetic tights. My famous blue outdoor research hat. This uh, very lightweight tank top that I'll wear for sleeping. Um, I also have a long sleeve light shirt that I'm going to use in lieu of sunscreen on my arms that is waiting for me in Calif California. And uh, two underwears, you don't need to see that really. Okay, um, two bras. This is the Icebreaker Siren Merino Wool Bra, and I like them. Uh, long sleeve merino wool, uh, lightweight shirt, also for warmth. Um, Ghost Whisperer puffy jacket without the hood. And for hiking, I have this Arcteric hiking dress, um, and I'm bringing it because it's cute. This is the rest of my gear, not pictured, is my quilt. I'm getting the Katabek 15 degree uh, Fahrenheit uh, quilt shipped to San Diego, and that's gonna go into this Z-Pax dry sack. Um, I'm also going to be using the Neo Air x Lite women's sleeping pad, um, and I ordered a new headlamp that's rechargeable, and I ordered a new case for my phone, um, and that and poles, I'm using Black Diamond women's trail poles, same poles I used on the Appalachian Trail. Um, but those will be waiting in San Diego. For my tent, um, same tent as the Appalachian Trail, the Six Moons Designs Skyscape X Cuban Fiber Tent, and I uses five titanium stakes, and I have a piece of poly uh, polychiro, that, you know, that plasticky stuff to put on the bottom uh, to keep the bottom of the tent clean. Okay, uh, let's look at some of the, the little stuffs. So um, I have some Cuban fiber tape for repairs. This um, is some uh, tape that I can cut to put on blisters. Uh, toothpaste, a light load towel, that's a hair tie. Uh, body glide for chafing. 
This is uh, camp soap, so shampoo, clothing, uh, and uh, body wash. And dishes, too, but I don't even have any dishes, so. Uh, these are toe separators uh, because sometimes my little baby toe goes underneath the other one, and so I wear them. Floss. This is a hair clip. Oops. Contact lenses. Ugh. I put my eyeglasses in this case. This is antifungal cream because sometimes uh, you get a rash and if you don't have the cream, then you're in big, big trouble. Sunglasses. This is Velcro to attach the Dirty Girl gaiters on new trail shoes, if and when I get them. Two uh, insect wipes, because I hardly ever, ever wear insect repellent. I'd prefer to cover up. Uh, chapstick with SBF. Oop, hairbrush. This is a Deuce of Spades uh, trowel to dig the hole uh, for poop. This is another toe separator that escaped the bag. This is a P-style stand-up pee device. So much ibuprofen. Oops. Um... Pepto-Bismol packets. This is hand sanitizer and a sanitizer wipe. This is anti-diarrhea stuff. This is uh, oral rehydration. This is a little lighter. These are for nausea. This is uh, some blood thinners because I have a problem just in case I have them. I'm taking one action wipe. This is for emergencies where I feel really, really sweaty and dirty and I can't take it, take it no more. Scissors. This is like blister stuff. And we have here oral pain relief. Uh, cotton swabs. Bond, uh, Bond-Aids. This is a Snudo mini compass. And shout out to Snudo because they gifted this uh, little compass to me. And uh, hydrocortisone cream. This is sewing stuff for repairs and some safety pins. Emergency light. Allergy medication. 110 SPF. I hate sunburns. Oh, and I forgot to mention, I have a, um, a mosquito net inside my glasses case. I, I wrapped around my glasses to keep them safe. These are uh, blister pads. These are tablets for purifying water. I have, I'm gonna try the Be Free um, water filter from Katadin, Katie Din. And it's waiting for me in San Diego, but these are just backups for water purification in case that filter fails. Uh, little packets of polysporin. These are uh, menstrual hygiene thingies and uh, antifungal cream. Actually, I, I, I don't need to take this because I got a big tube, so this can stay. Uh, burn gel and one little skin lotion. Uh, also in San Diego, I have a very lightweight type buff thing that it, I can use for wearing and it's multi-purpose to help filter water. And I'll show you that when I actually start hiking. So with electronics, this is an anchor power bank. It charges my iPhone three to four times. Uh, headphones. This is my very old school uh, iPod that's stuck in frozen in time in 2008 because it doesn't work anymore when I plug it in, but the, the playlist is still on there. And uh, the button has fallen off and I've repaired it with some band-aids. Uh, I'll, I'll keep taking this hiking till it dies. And then this is my iPhone cord and then um, USB block that everything else plugs into. I'm going to take this Montbell Super Light purse, and this is my wallet where I have my money, my cards, my passport, my PCT permit, etc. Okay, 
two packages of tissues. And this is um, Z Packed Food I have an order proof bag inside. And uh, <laughs> I'm only taking <laughs> for the first day. It's a, you know, these, you know, people, they like to plan out all their foods for months and months in advance. Well, I'm, I'm just going to fly by and see my pants. I'm just taking three cliff bars for the first day. Uh, we'll see how that works out. I plan on um, eating dinner at a cafe the first day. Okay. Um, garbage bag liner. And um, this is um, a Z Packs Zero backpack. It's uh, pretty small, and uh, I've been using it for a few years, and I've repaired it quite a bit with duct tape, you can see inside, and Cuban fiber tape. Uh, we'll see if it lasts this hike. If not, I'll just order something else midway through the, the hike and uh, replace this bag. So there you have it. That's my backpack. Um, when I get to San Diego tomorrow and I pick up the rest of my packages at Scout and Frodo's house, I'm going to pack my bag and I'm going to weigh it and I will post in the comments below what the weight will be leaving San Diego. And uh, I'm going to be video blogging every day and if I change any gear, I will mention it because I'm I like to change things around a lot. So um, you'll see things being tossed into the pit and new additions, additions flying into the pack. And I'm going a little bit crazy because uh, I, don't, I don't know if I'm gonna sleep tonight. <laughs> I still got a bunch of stuff to do. And um, San Diego tomorrow.